This year is unusual. Instead of the uh, state tournament being at US Cellular Center, it was at the Ice Arena. We came here to do the photo uh, on the ice before they switched over to putting a floor down for the volleyball floor uh, so we could show the uh, some of the local teams that made the state tournament. We could photograph some of their players. Uh, in the hockey venue. I will have to say we had some uh, makeup artists come that did a great job to help out. Uh, some students from Capri College and former students from Capri came and did makeup so the girls kind of looked their best and felt uh, you know, like they were uh, going to be in a, co a magazine cover. Uh, I think the girls had fun hopefully that's kind of the whole point of doing this kind of shoot is to have fun do something a little different and something creative. That's true. <laughs> okay, all right, I want you guys to look here. I want you guys to give me some game faces. Oh, some oh god. Oh my god. This is the wet one closer, right? I think it looks better, you're right. Well, when I do the dry cut, I'm taking the towel off. Yeah. So, yeah. any microscopic imperfection in the blade or a deep skate groove, you're going to see those deformities in the ice. Yeah, the wet looks, Whereas, looks really yeah. good. It's got a nice kind of sheen to it. Right. So, right. Cool, thank you. It's difficult to like because it's such a big venue, um, and unlike U.S. Cellular Center or Hard Carver Hawkeye where we have strobes in the catwalk or can put strobes in the catwalk, I uh, had to kind of use light stands and improvise, and it's a big space to fill, and it took a lot of lights to kind of overwhelm the ambient light so I could get uh, the light how I wanted it, light I could control.